for this matchup. Take a look at Michigan State. Uh, they're coming off a one nothing win over Laurel or Chicago on a Sunday, and they'll go with a 4-4-2, and they're dealing with some injuries. Yeah, they do have some injuries. Montego in particular up front is out. Stacy goes from his normal left midfield position up front. Prolicki in for the start, but these guys are strong up the middle. Keener and Carroll, awesome back line defense there. Damon Rensing is in his uh, sixth season as head coach of Michigan State. He played for the legendary Joe Baum, who coached for 32 <laughs> seasons at Michigan State. And really, we are seeing two programs that have great history. Maryland Terrapins, Sasha Sarovsky, they were in the College Cup final last year before a loss to Notre Dame. They really have adjusted things here. Yeah, they have adjusted things here. And part of the reason is because they're all healthy in the midfield now. That midfield diamond led by Dan Metzger at the holding midfield is one of the best in the country. Watch for them. 22nd season in charge at College Park, the University of Maryland, and he has really helped not only develop this team the way they play on the field, he has 16 pros of responding. And one of your keys, surviving the first 10, 15 minutes, and I think they're more than surviving. They're, they're doing that right now, and I uh, feel a little bit good going forward as well. I mean, they've got some really crafty players in the attack, and if they can go forward and face Maryland a bit, they, they will cause problems. Points the flick to Stacy, nicely done. Stacy weaving through the shot, it's in the net! Michigan State has scored! Stacy, a left footed finish, and Michigan State is all right. Well, I would say, Dave, that is absorbing pressure pretty well in the first 15 minutes. And Stacy being put up top, we said he was put there, usually plays the left midfield, proving Coach Rensing correct. As we watch this replay, we also see we talked about Kreutz at the top of the thing, and Kreutz heads the ball through. Stacy, a nice touch to the inside. He wants to go to his favorite left foot. Look at that, Dave. That's a topo from 18 yards out. Well. Stacy scores. He had been the assist man for Michigan State, as you mentioned, playing the left side of midfield. Schools are these two teams, and we'll explain that as well. Sasha Swarovski is a Michigan native, or at least he grew up in Michigan. The head coach at Maryland. Ken Perlicki now. Chapman. The skilled number 10, and he wears that jersey. It's fitting that he has it. Now her. The right back getting forward. Lewis running into space. Michigan State now. This is Lewis coming through, trying to make. That's something from Maryland that you look at scoring woes. Often you look at the forwards and say, well, they're not finishing. But Sasha Swarovski saw to us this week, the head coach, part of it is they've had the inconsistency with players in the midfield, hoping tonight would be different. So far, not the case. The top, Alasha. Now her, the right back. A lot of a kick. Maryland would dearly love to equalize before the break. Pernally puts it off the post. Not done. Dewey adds up, gets it out to Sowers. Yeah, just have a look at this corner kick. And Cardali, one of the reasons he's in there is because the six foot five frame can get off, gets it right off the post because they had Kralicki right there at the post. If it was anywhere inside, again, this corner kick put in. Have him look in. Now, here's a great header because he's got. Yeah, just have a look at this corner kick. And Cardali, one of the reasons he's in there is because the six foot five frame can get off, gets it right off the post because they had Kralicki right there at the post. If it was anywhere inside, again, this corner kick put in. Have him look in. Now, here's a great header because he's got players. Not done. Finally, Chapman leads the charge. And this has promise. But Dewey Atsum reads it well with Tim Kreutz trying to get onto it for Michigan State. Well, you saw Chapman almost uh, play Kreutz through there, and that's one of the challenges Maryland has, chase the game without leaving a lot of space behind. Sowers, that's good quality. Campbell, Chapman intervenes, a teacher. Good defending from her, Corbos. Wow, Zach Bennett has to snare that as... Yeah, it was looking bending. Looking up 90 there. Yeah, it was bending a little bit too much, a little bit more than he thought it was, but the goal, Kreutz uh, headed that ball past. Throwing coming up, or pardon me, Michigan State now with possession. Crystal ball, crystal ball, crystal ball. So you know, has to be sure about that and you know, have a look at this angle. And well, it wasn't going wide initially, but after we got the play, he can hit the ball though. He got a lot of players in the box there, and there's going to be something coming here. Looping it in. It's caution to the win. Everybody on deck. Stefan for Rayleigh. Rayleigh 
will send it in. The header by Ambrose. Oh, Mikey Ambrose. You can see the twine. Almost got this back. The ball coming in. What a great service there. And the header looks like it's going. Mikey Ambrose, look at that. Cleared off the line. Zach Carroll, what a great get for Michigan State. And he saved the game right there. Well, Damon. Fantastic season. What a match tonight. But in the end, there was no sharing. Michigan State grabbed it all with a 1-0 win on a Jason Stacy goal.